going on, guys? Oh, fuck. Thumbs out to need now. Back in this bitch, and we're bringing you, hopefully, what is going to be the final part of Liberty City Stories, uh, Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, guys, today's Sunday, and as you see, I'm repping today. Rams are going to be playing the Lions in a few hours. <clears throat> but, of course, I got to get my stream out of the way first before I go and celebrate festivities. Got to keep it PG-13 today, though, because tomorrow I do have work. Got to be a responsible citizen. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to drink. So I already got my beer of choice right here in hand. Um, but, yeah, guys, this should be the last part. <clears throat> and as soon as I beat it, um, during the final credits is when I'll announce the, um, the game that I've chosen to play next. Like I said, some will be upset. Some will be happy. But me personally, I feel like it's, it needs to be done. Um, but yeah. Alrighty, guys. But without further ado, let's get right into this part. This is the last part of GTA Liberty City Stories. Let's get right into this hoe. Oplex. How you doing, my boy? I missed your last stream, bro. It's all good, buddy. It was a little early in the morning, um, just as this one, but obviously it's because I'm going to do some stuff later on. But yeah, let's get right into this shit, guys. Uh, but yeah, Oplex, I should, this should be um, <clears throat> the last part. I've made it pretty far already, so yeah, let me see. Uh, hold up. Let me do something for good measures. I want to make sure that this stream doesn't just go down the hole. All right, cool. Uh, but you've been grinding the stream thing. Keep it up. Well, fuck, dude, you got to do it. You know what I mean? You, you got to fucking do it. <clears throat> I don't even remember why I'm on this other side. But yeah, guys, like I said, I'm keeping a PG-13 today, but I'm still going to drink. So cheers, bitches. Oh, fuck. Making a mess over here. Oh, like you should have been there in the last part, though. I downed a whole fucking... <clears throat> I downed a whole uh, bottle of um, champagne within like an hour. <laughs> it's fucking horrible. I was, I, was, I was pretty drunk. I'm not going to lie, guys. In the last part, I was actually pretty drunk. <laughs> Getting towards the end of it. That's why I just... Well, I mean, for personal reasons, I stopped the stream. But also, too, I was glad because I was like, dude, I'm fucking drunk. <clears throat> and the thing that sucks is I don't have any weapon. Oh my god, dude. Alright, this one should be a little faster. There you go. Um, Makes more entertaining to watch. Yeah, I mean... It was literally, bro, all I wanted to do was just enjoy my Saturday and have some mimosas. And what happened... Was that I poured my first thing of mimosa and or a uh, champagne and it was like all fizzy. So I was like, I'm not gonna mix this with my orange juice, so I just drank it. And then I went my with my second pour and I did like about three quarters of champagne and one quarter of it orange juice, but I, I honestly just did it for the stream. Um And then I drank that and then I, I refilled and I did about like half champagne, half orange juice, you know, I kept it pretty normal. And then when I went to go pour my last one, I realized it's like, bro, I'm almost done with the bottle. I might as well finish it. And then I just poured the rest of it and yeah, I just killed it off. So. <clears throat> but I was pretty drunk. But yeah, guys, as far as football goes, the Texans beat um, the Browns. Then um, the Chiefs beat the Dolphins. I don't know, guys. It's, it's getting a little bit more interesting. So, Oplex, I don't know if you're in a football or not, but I mean, I try to keep up as much as I can during the playoffs. The regular season, it's not super hard. 
to like keep up with because there's only like a couple like 17 games i believe 18 weeks <clears throat> but like baseball and basketball i don't keep up with that shit i aim to please what's next princess my husband is moving a great quantity of cash from his casino i want you to destroy all of that money oh i can find a damn good use for that money sweetheart I want his money burning in the street for all to see. Okay, okay. When's this move gonna happen? <laughs> oh, Oakley, did you, um... Did you watch the UFC right fight now. yesterday with, uh... Johnny Walker and Magomed? <clears throat> Johnny Walker got fucking slept. Yeah, well, that's... I, I just read your comment, too, and that's why I brought it up. <clears throat> oh, shit. Wait, I need a fucking rocket launcher for this. Damn it. I think this was the last mission that I tried doing uh, yesterday. Um. Oh, I can just go to Phil's. What the fuck song was this dude listening to? Ah, uh, me just one. All right, this is gonna be easy right here. Watch, guys. I just don't want to blow him up when I'm like super close. There we go. <laughs> that was easy as fuck. Um, alright, now I can go back to the other bit. Dexoless, what's up? What's going on, buddy? Um, Oplex, yeah, <clears throat> he dropped them and ref immediately stopped them. Yeah, I mean, he, he got, he got knocked out, dude, I, I, that... That punch actually uh, got him good, and then whenever he was on the ground, uh, Magomed still fucking landed one more. I was like, oh fuck. I, it was a good stoppage, though. I, I didn't watch the rest of the, the card, though, if I'm gonna be honest. Anyone home? Mr. Tony? Yeah, I didn't, I, that, I didn't watch any of the fights, dude. I was busy. My so. husband is furious. He wonders how you come but this to weekend, Sean Strickland, so the boy, versus Unless DDP. He's a fool, he'll work it out soon enough. Perhaps we should help him. His men gossip like old women. Let's give them something to talk about. Where are we going? The opera. The opera? Me? You kidding? Don't be ridiculous, Mr. Tony. The Everyone fuck? loves the opera. Not if you're, like, into mobs and shit. If you bring shit. my car around, we can collect your tuxedo. We don't have long. The show starts very soon. XLS said, nothing, bro. Well, go get yourself a fucking beer. Let's drink it up, homie. You know, it's Sunday, but fuck it. You gotta be responsible. The opera's beginning at 20. Don't be late. Get out of the way, buddy. Um, okay. Yeah, it was a good stoppage. Landed a good one. My boy, Sean. Deshaun Strickland. Dude, I low-key want a shirt that says Deshaun Strickland. That'd be hella funny. Come on, bitch. Oh wait, I have to go get her car. Oh my god, a limo? Oh, fuck! <laughs> At least there was a... Oh my god, and then there's a cop right there too. I might get arrested right here, guys. <laughs> uh, I'm already drank too much yesterday. Today's a chill day. <clears throat> Every day's a drinking day, buddy. As long as you can handle it. No, I'm just kidding. If you went too hard yesterday and you're recovering today, fuck it. But you do know the best remedy for a hangover is another beer. So. I don't have any fucking guns. Anyone home? Mr. Tony? If you bring my car around. Who the hell do you think you are? Hey! 
Hey, get off the street. Get on the <coughs> Hey, Oplex, what do you think about that fight, though? Like, honest take, what do you think about it? Let me know. I had bet one of my friends, I think, like, 50 bucks, and I had a uh, Sean. Let's go, bitch. You know, I thought you cared about the environment. Melissa, look at me. Get a change of outfit. Do you think I'm a bad person, Mr. Tony? Yes. I ain't exactly a saint. No, a saint wouldn't be much use to me. Look, <clears throat> Tony does what he does for money and status. I don't know what you're doing your shit for. You know, you're supposed to have a husband or some shit. And you're over here doing this shit and want to see, like, all of his Yakuza shit go down the drain. for a good cause. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's the shirt that I want. It's the one that where he's wearing the do rag and everything, and he's holding the henny bottle. That's that's funny as fuck. <laughs> this Sean Strickland. My husband is samurai, Mr. Tony. He is very strong, but very, very bad. I'll kill your he fucking only husband. Me to become Makakashira in Liberty City. He has never loved me. He prefers the company of his men. Do you understand? When he finds out what you're doing, you know he's gonna kill you. I do not care for life or death anymore. Only oh yeah. What a relaxing worldview. My point exactly. Um, all right, I'm gonna stop by the. Fuck. Wait, I have a minute left. Um, I I know I'm gonna need those guns, dude. So let me. I need to make a quick pit stop at the ammunition because I don't have any fucking guns. Uh, fuck, I might not even make it. Alright, I have 40 seconds, guys. 40 fucking seconds. <laughs> Wait, isn't that a meme with that one guy? It took you 40 seconds to piss me off, that fucking little nerd dude. Twenty seconds. Oh no, he said four seconds. I remember. It, we're almost there. Ten seconds. Yeah. <clears throat> so what you got going on today, Dexolus? Or I don't know how to pronounce your name. Dexolus. <clears throat> Fuck out of my way. <gasps> Bitch, stop following me. What happened? I didn't even see no opera show. Oh my god. Shut up, bitch. Tony got T-boned like crazy right there. Shut up, bitch. What do you think I'm doing? Oh my god. I'm gonna get T-boned right here, watch. Nah, there's a bunch of shit going on over there. Fuck! Bro, these guys are like fucking aggressive. They don't give a fuck about their own life, dude. There we go. Get out of my way. Bro, this limo is trash. Good luck fixing it, bitch. Ah, I should have went the other way. Fuck out of my way. Alright, here we go. I hear him right behind me, but I already made it, so... Oh. <laughs> I 
Oh my god, now they know. Alright, let's go on. Oh. Cash in Kaz Kazuki's chips. Hello. I'm bathing, Tony san. <clears throat> we have little time left. My husband knows now who is truly behind his losses. He's coming to kill me. And you. Well, I ain't waiting here for him. Where is he? He's in Belleville, gathering his men. But soon, he will come here. Well, sayonara, sweetheart. My prayers go with you, Tony-san. Good luck. Head over to somewhere. <clears throat> Bro, that guy is fucking fast. He runs faster than his car. Where am I supposed to go anyway? Uh, okay. Fuck, dude. Ah, dude, that guy fell off the fucking... <laughs> off the... Yeah, so did that guy. <laughs> Both of them fell off the road. Off the bridge, I mean. Gunning for me, fuck. I don't know why Tony agreed to do any of these missions for this chick. First, a breathing world. Is kill. Fuck. Should be more that's gonna come. A fucking helicopter. Thank. Oh, well, do I still have my rocket launcher? Or did I die? I think I still have it. I hope this one doesn't have a flat. That's good. Look out, here come more Yakuza's. <clears throat> At least I have a fast car this time around. I like the fucking limo. Am I supposed to kill him or? I think I should like go from behind. Do I still have it? No, I don't, but so funny. Basically gonna shoot my way through the back. a lot easier than I thought or never mind there we go I 
I need that. I need to kill that guy. There we go. Um. <clears throat> my men dishonor me, but it is fitting that I kill you myself. You too. Leave us. I'm just gonna I'm fucking. Oh, no, don't give me no sword. I'm just gonna pull out my gun and I'll fucking blow your face out. Yeah, I heard that about you. Oh my god, that guy actually has quite a bit of health. Give me your gun. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't gonna do no samurai shit with him. I was just gonna fucking kill his face. Or kill his ass. I have two cotton. Well, isn't that bad fucking plastic? <clears throat> At least the car's there. Be for a clean getaway. There's the car. What the fuck? I could have just walked to her apartment. <laughs> so, uh, Toshiko. It's over now. Yes. Yes, I knew that. Hello, Mr. Tony. Hey, so, um, you won. <laughs> you got what you wanted. Everything worked out great. Great. Yes, great. Really great. So it's, uh, payment time, sweetheart. Dead ass. We're both of us fools and killers, Mr. Tony. I guess we are. The world takes such a terrible toll on your spirit. Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Tony? So I have to kill her yes. now. But uh, you're free now. I mean, you can uh, go to uh, Costa Rica or Aruba or some shit. <laughs> Start over new, that's what you always wanted. Yeah. I don't think I'm ready for a beach holiday, Mr. Tony. I've lost everything. And I have done so deliberately. Why is she trying to make things so dramatic? Just pay Tony his money, go to fucking Costa Rica, and leave us the fuck alone. Everything I asked for. Now, I just ask to be truly free. Goodbye, Tony son. I don't get it. Woman. Fucking woman. <clears throat> Only four thousand? Where did she jump from, anyways? Oh fuck! He was just jumping in front of my car. All right, I'm glad I'm done with her missions. Let's go back to Donald and see what's good with that guy. Oh, he's on the other island. Yeah, short step though. I'm being an asshole, guys. Watch this. Oh, fuck! Nah, I don't have a big enough car. Nah, that guy's brakes are good then. Go! Oh, 
Oh shit, I'll just take that bike. And his money. Only had like 40 bucks up. Shore side veil. Jump it. Hurry up, I'm late for a swinging party. Damn, you lost a lot of health doing that shit. Get this uh hidden package. Uh Pandlantic something, I don't know what the shit what the shit said. Where is he anyways? Is he hiding? <laughs> I know what you're thinking, don't you? How the mighty have fallen. But this is just a temporary blip, my man. Okay. <laughs> oh, don't be all touchy. I know I said some nasty things about this being your fault and all, but... Hubris is a nasty, nasty. I don't think Tony cares. Almost as nasty as termites. And trust me, I've tried both recently. Wait. You and me are on our way back. I never went away. <laughs> we're in this together, amigo. No, we're not. Please. Damn, that one didn't do anything. Please. Please. Forget about it, buddy. It's all your yeah. fault. That ten percent. Ten percent of what? This? Oh, you're too kind. Not of this. Of something really big. Oh. Come. I'll tell you about another <laughs> drive. I hope you have your car. Mine's in the uh, uh shop. Yeah, sure. I don't think this will has a car. You need a vehicle. Well, thank God there's one behind over here. Go, oh, bitch. Head for the airport, Tony. The airport? Well, that's all we have time for. Next time. Oh, yes. One of my better plans, for sure. I never knew I had it in me. Even Avery would be proud. Well, what are you going to do? Just leave? <clears throat> I remember what my daddy said. Don't you tell nobody about me coming in here at night. I think Avery is one of the guys from uh, the original Vice Cities. I think it's a cowboy guy. Bro, they're not going to let him get away like that, though. They're probably going to try to kill him before he leaves. I hope not, knock on wood, because I don't want to deal with that, but... Tony, my oh, there's Avery. Avery Carrington is flying into town today. It's come to my attention that he's working for the Panlantic Corporation. They'll do anything to get prime real estate. We have to get hold of his plans to acquire land. So are we gonna kill him? Wow. Oh, this guy. Oh my god. Be careful, his funds will be lost. If, oh my god, okay. I'm already not liking this mission. What are we gonna do then? And I just get in the middle? Alright, well there goes that car. Donald was killed. 
I need a better car than that. I'm just trying to think about how I can do it. Because if I just ram him... I don't know how I'm going to do it. Because he doesn't seem like... Donald or the Donald, the Avery guy doesn't seem like... His driving time doesn't seem like he's going to stop or do any of that. It looks like he's just going to keep going. This mission is probably going to be on a bike, but <clears throat> I need to find a bike. Uh, Tony, transportation would be a boot. Shut up, bitch. Well, we'll just take this one and then we'll just find a better one. <laughs> he has a full fucking uh, mustache and beard. Oh, oh there's health right there. I could use that. I never knew I had it in me. Even Avery would be proud. Uh, yeah. Let's just. There's a cop right now. There's... Like, come on. Not how 1987 are you a go-to joke? How basic? Yup, you got me there. What's next? A mud? <laughs> next caller. Hi, I was wondering what you guys thought of that movie. Controversial Well, first off, if this were a chat room, I would be typing with one hand. All right, you guys. Let's try doing this over again. The thing that sucks is that I don't think um, Donald has a gun on him. So it's not like he could help me shoot. He wants me to do the, all the work. Fuck, dude. Alright, well that guy's tires are flat. Dude! Blow up his car, blow up his car, blow up his car. Perfect. Oh, capital Tony. Quite literally. Come on. Let's get this back to the safety well, get your fucking ass in the damn truck. We still have one more after us. Well, let me take the AKs, though. I got a Lord Lothar's meeting to go to. We'll just take this car. Please, don't make me walk. Come on, Donald. That's crazy how they just kill him so, like, bluntly like that in this game. They don't even give any background on him because, like, I'm telling you, oh, shit. Like, I'm telling you, in, in Vice City, you do a bunch of missions for that guy. And in this game, they make him seem like he's a very insignificant character. I mean, I don't remember the shit that I would do for him, but I know he played some sort of a part in the whole story. So, damn. Need some more help. Stop the press.
Tony, at last, a reporter witnessed us killing Avery. He has photos. Oh, God, I'm finished. Calm down, will you? Where is this reporter? Uh, oh, Tony, you're wonderful. Apparently, he's working tired of this dude. Undercover job at the church on Staten Island. Get the photos and bury him. <laughs> Damn, there's no um health right there. <clears throat> An island. Can we just stop coming back to this fucking place? Oh, there goes that car. Oh man, let's go. Get some health people on that. Fuck. Bro, at this fucking rate, I'm gonna end up dying. Who's that? Go, bitch! Go! Hey, stupid. Wake up. The big man wants to talk to you. I'm very clear about this. I mean, oh, sure, you can have a, a glass of Chateau de Buff Cabernet with dinner, or but do you have any idea what this is doing to you, stupid? Or where this ends? No. Now, listen, you know what? This is this a church? Oh fuck. Oh, I'm here to kill that one reporter guy. <laughs> you got some photos of me. Where are they? I don't know what you're talking about. Just kill him. Where are the goddamn photos? Don't hurt me. Where are they? Please, no. Come on, you little pussy, give him up. Okay, okay, I'll get you the photos. I stashed the film in my locker. Where? This is a fucking a burial ground? What? He's gonna set him up. You piece of shit. Yep. Kill Ned Burner. Should be easy. Or maybe not. This is an automated drive, so. Bro, that guy's just eating bullets. <laughs> come on, come on, hurry the fuck up. I should have sold that chopper. Oh, go. Oh, there you go. Fuck, okay. There he is. Now, 
Why is he driving on the opposite side of the road? Oh my god. Where is he? Where is he? Fuck! Give me that fucking bike, dude. See how fast that little shit it really is. There we go. Now let's go back to Donald and finish up his missions. Do it to you. And I ain't talking about using the tradesman's interest. Have, have, have you ever heard of a coat hanger? Who in the bright mind gets off of a cab in the middle of the road out here on a bridge? God damn, this fucking bike's fast. Oh, that was smooth right there. I'm back! Back from the dead, Tony! Risen in you like a phoenix from the ashes! Like Lazarus! Yes! Lazarus love! Ah, I'm gonna be rich again! Pan Lantern are gonna pay me a fortune to see the deal through! We did it, Tony! Whatever. It's time for a little soiree with a very exclusive guest list. Bro, the Wi-Fi in Colorado sucks. Your stream keeps freezing. Bro, what are you doing in Colorado? We don't have much time. <laughs> yeah, I just ran a performance check. It's definitely... Uh, my shit's good. It's your shit. <clears throat> uh, airport security will lock Avery... Okay. Tony, I've been dying for this party. Just like hey, wait, where am I going? Oh, find it works. Let me help you here. Why do people? Um, oh, fuck. This, this mission's gonna take a minute. And I'm also assuming it's gonna be one of those missions where you go to one of them and it's automatically not that one. Uh, no, I need to go down right here. The big up and down below. About the fiery cheesecake of hell. Do you know who created Darwin? Well, it wasn't a monkey. Christmas is about more than the set of fire with the red suit. It's big, you know. Sometimes we do get confused with all the police cartoon specials on the TV. Now look like a native cartoon. Some work to do. All right. Go on, Coming up next on Heartland Values with Nurse Bob. I would go three or four times a week. My friends thought I was really into water slides or theme parks. I'm so ashamed. Okay, let's just steal it. This is it. Oh wait, no, I just needed an ambulance. Oh, hey, 
Oh, it was this one. Damn. You used to feed me such pearls of wisdom. And soon I shall die again. Bro, you're fucking weird, dog. <laughs> you are weird. Oh my god, he's wearing a wig. Oh shit, this was not the right play. <laughs> Fuck, okay. This is why I always look at the maps before I start driving. That honestly pissed me off. That pissed me the fuck off. Yeah, that that genuinely fucking made me mad. I don't even know what the fuck happened. I think my thumb just accidentally went and pushed the Analog stick to go right. Ugh. We're gonna need some transportation, Tony. We don't have much time. Shut the fuck up. Tony, I've been dying for this party. Just like my guests. So one, the one that should have it is the one up there, so... Damn, dude. And what makes it even worse now is I don't have any weapons. Uh, I don't think that's... Yeah, I don't have any weapons, and I know that this, this type of mission is going to require me to do some sort of gun plays. So. fucking focus right now. I don't even care about commentary or talking. Ah, uh, yeah, piss me off. <laughs> um, okay, he's all the way over there. That's way far, though. Oh, Avery, how you've aged since we've last met. You used to feed me such pearls of wisdom. And soon I shall die again. Oh. My God, he's wearing a wig! Something tells me this isn't him. He's over here doing fucking this work.
Alright, almost there, guys. <laughs> almost fucking there. Where was it that I fell off? I think I already passed it. Man, that was so shitty, dude. Oh no! What are you doing, Tony? You fucking idiot! Come on, Tony. We haven't got long. Shut up, bitch. Yeah, get in the back. Tony, take me and Avery over to his Bro, these guys know this is gonna be bullshit, so I highly doubt they're gonna let us in. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, they're not letting us in. Alright, here we go, guys. Or never mind, I thought I was gonna get like five stars right now. Watch, just watch this. It's gonna be a fucking full blown gunfight. I don't have any fucking guns. Uh, it got a little better. Be Good. sure to get Ned Burner's corpse here before security discovers us. They'll be interring him any time now. Bro, I don't have guns. Ned's? Oh my god. Okay, let's see. Oh, his isn't that far. Dude, all right. Right back after this. Go on, girl. Okay to cry. Coming up next on Heartland Values with Nurse Bob. I would go three or four times a week. My friends thought I was really into water slides or theme parks. I'm so ashamed. Now, Chris, when you look at men playing golf, what are you thinking, boy? Sticking that ball boy. in the rain, huh? No? <coughs> we fit you enjoy the game or the shower afterwards. It's time to get some value. Who made you God? Why are you acting like the Supreme Being? You better break this shit. I'm talking about right now. Because otherwise, you are going to burn. Look, I, I've got some fire lighters here right now. I've got some I've got some road players in the bottle of fair, but you want me to set you on fire. Brett just you broke the gate. Hey, yeah, he just went under it. Staten Island. Today on Heartland Values with Nurse Bob. Yeah, Mike's been body drinking for a while now. Well, he really gets mad sometimes. Oh, Mikey, what did you do? In your pants again? Shut up, bitch. Jesus, cut me some slack. He hides in his room, the whole theater room. He doesn't eat. There's beer cans everywhere. He's constantly touching himself. Oh, yeah, fuck, like dude. <laughs> I have two fucking cops. Yeah, but like I'm saying, two cops isn't hard to shake off. It's three cops that it gets challenging. Two cops, like, you'll get one cop here and there waiting for you, coming towards you. Like, it's not even that bad, and they're not even that aggressive I mean, or fast. Um, three cops, on the other hand, it's like, they don't give a fuck. They do not give a fuck. And then one cop, I mean, it's realistically, it's, it's nothing. Sure, side veil. Is this the last mission? I don't think so, dude. I, I, I don't think so. I think I still got a few more before then. I'll pull up the, the mission list. 
Hurry up, uh, 22. Fuck. Yeah, I should make it. How can you be so dumb? Did you climb the stupid tree and hit every branch on the way down? You may remember our show a few months ago with Chuck. Now, Chuck and his wife have been married for three months. Easy. All right, I'm going to look this up real quick. Because yeah, I think I should be pretty close. I'm well, good because I'm awaiting a phone call. Tony, Donald here. If the Panlantic deal is to come to fruition, we're going to need to, um, how can I put this delicately? Clear a small section of land in Fort Star. Yeah, when you say we, you mean me, right? No, Tony, you see right through me. Go and see 8-Ball. I'm sure he can provide us with the necessary hardware. Fuck, I still have quite a few. <laughs> so there's two more with 8-Ball, there's one with Donald, and there's two with Salvatore after that. So that's a total of, like, six missions. I think I should still get it done, though. I don't see why not. I have time. So there's two missions with 8-Ball, then there's one more mission with Donald, and then there's two missions with Salvatore. So that's, yeah, that's five missions. Yeah, that should be pretty easy. I, I don't... I don't foresee 8-Ball's missions being too hard. But which means I need to start playing a little, like, better and not just fucking crash into concrete walls like that. Um, yeah, I can't be playing like a total idiot. Whenever you get your wanted level to like a certain degree, yeah, they definitely bring out all the fucking SWAT and the whole army. That's funny. Uh, holy shit. I thought that guy was going after me. I was like, what the fuck's wrong with him? The homie ate ball. No money, mo problem. Donald sent me to pick up some uh, hardware. hardware. All right, I got what you boys need, but it's gonna cost. Don said you'd pay me up front, and he'd reimburse you later. Yeah, Betty did. Now where's the hardware? Shit, son. Hardware like this takes time to put together. I'll be in touch. Uh, okay. So how long does that take? I need missions to do, guys. I can't just fucking. Not do anything. I'll just go to the safe house and save. I was going to the drive safe house <clears throat> well, I mean this gives me a good opportunity to save
Uh, I'll probably save a full day, but I want to change this outfit. It looks dumb as fuck. <laughs> I mean, it's only right, right? Gotta finish off with the Leonis, too. And let me save two more times. Because I think it's probably a full two, um... A full day needs to go by in the game. So if every save, um... Advances the game by six hours. And you do this four times. All right. So now he should be getting a call. Or not. Let me see this real quick, guys. <clears throat> oh, there it is. My man, this is 8-Ball. Your hardware is ready to ship out. Yeah, so... All um, Tony really did was go home and sleep for a whole day and come back. Uh, let's go quick way. Okay, going around. Yeah, this mission is quite interesting. Um, so, <clears throat> obviously, before I did the last part, I was um, just kind of looking ahead at some missions. And this mission right here is pretty interesting. So, uh, you guys will see one night when I uh, get to it. Bringing the house down. All right, so Look, technically, man, there's three missions left. No, I'm saying drive cool. Or four. Yeah. It's all good. Sure. I'll put them on. Tony, we're one little job away from being fabulously rich. We've scoured plans of Fort Staunton. Its weakest points are along the old subway that runs underneath the area. Great, Don. <laughs> all I gotta do is dodge a hundred wacko Italians. Bro, that guy has just a fucking Molotov in his hand. And you'll find your way in just fine. Come on, visit him. In the van. <clears throat> yeah, so basically what I have to do is fucking bomb the, the bridges. So. I think I have to go. Be oh, I have to go to either one of those to get over there. Yeah, that shouldn't be too hard. Don't let Rellies wreck the van. Am I, am I going the right way? Yeah. Just got worse. It's Fuck. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. And of course, like, there has to be another gang that has to get all involved in shit, so. crashing all crazy back there too I mean you hear that shit what at least I'm not that bad of a driver all right what do I do what do I do what do I do okay perfect okay this is where shit's gonna get dicey because they don't have um because there's no more traffic to hit them and shit, so they're gonna be hitting me like pretty 
Never mind. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, why my shit's all laggy now? Man, it was beautiful. That's the power of rock and roll, the way Crow does it. We're all one love. Crow first. Oh, fuck. I'm almost there. Shut up. Uh, anyway, that's all we have time for. Crow's new album will be out soon. And dude, fuck. Shortly after that. This has been Bleeding World. Recycle, please. This is like a whole fucking maze. Plant the explosive. Blood curdling chef Richard Goblin. It's called. Oh, fuck. I don't know why Donald thinks this is a fucking get back in the van. Now I have two minutes to get out. Place the remaining. Oh. Oh fuck, I have to go in here. Bro, I might end up dying. This is culture, huh? You get discovery, huh? The culinary delights of snow. So let's eat the food. Okay, cool. I think I have one more left. We have one bomb left. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. I don't have a fucking gun. Genius, since you ask. Finesse in the kitchen. Oh. There we go. Uh, great. Yeah, whatever. I'm having a real problem with my stuffing. Ah, you a man? There's one dude right there. But I don't have a fucking gun. Yeah, fuck that. I'm taking the van. So I don't have fucking... Run! Moron. Tony Cipriati, assholes. <laughs> fuck, dude. Yeah, I'm fucked. I am fucked. I'll take their car, though. Oh, perfect. Is that it? Fuck yes. Ah, I thought there was going to be a lot more to that mission. Damn. <laughs> Oh my god! I think I didn't give a fuck. Wine is so sophisticated. <laughs> it's raining cars. <laughs> All right, now let's go to the last Donald mission. He's all the fuck we. All right, guys, it's looking pretty good. Three more missions. And I should really go get that some health. Or not health, but some armor. Some armor. Some more guns. That's all I need. I didn't even crash that cop. What the fuck? Damn. 
under the toilet bowl. Who in the bright mind just cuts left like that, you fucking idiot? Put on your signals. How to kill your ass. Shore side veil. Okay, let's see. Where's he at? He's all the way over there. Alright, here we go, guys. Last mission with Donald. Uh, is this his house? Damn. Head up to the house. Uh, I need another beer if I'm gonna do these last missions. Let me go get a beer. No good. Um, damn it! It's just so. Oh shit! If I just had something cold to cuddle up to, it'd be so easy. What's going on, D? Antonio. Oh, I'm just seeking spiritual enlightenment, if you must ask. But not today. Maybe tomorrow. Your message seemed kind of anxious. Anxious? <laughs> I'm I'm meditating. Anxious. Moi. I met one with the universe. That's Black, I'm, just I'm, impossible. <laughs> Whoa. I'm back, guys. Oh, shit. That's right. Um, there is a load of Colombians coming up here to potentially kill me. What? I thought this I was finished. Mouth shut and pay them all off. Oh, I guess that would explain all the uh, Colombians hovering around outside. <clears throat> oh, shit. Please, Antonio, you have to get me out of here. I don't want to. Please. I, I for the last three. So much for uh, being at one with the universe, huh? Oh, thank you, Tony. I'll make it. Oh, I'll make it worth your while. I promise. <coughs> Fuck yes, you should. God oh damn God, it, Tony! Do something. What do you want me to do? How did those guys not die from the fucking car explosion? Uh. Yeah, I'm already gonna fail this mission. I can tell you that from uh, that part right now. Tony, shoot him, bro. Why are you fucking? Oh my god, yeah, that. There's no way. There's no way. There might be a way. Yeah, just get those fucking cops out. Nope. Fuck! <sighs> and what's gonna suck is like, this is gonna be a 
it's gonna be a repeat over and over and over and what really fucked me up was <clears throat> that first truck that hit me because he took like half of my fucking armor but what sucks is like now going into it i don't have any guns Unless he puts, like, guns over here for me to take, but... Yeah, there ain't shit. <clears throat> so there's a health right there. I saw the health. Caterpillars. Oh my god, Tony, do something! Oh my god, yes, there was stuff in here. But I need guns, dude. This isn't gonna help. Okay, so there's health right there too. Hmm. I'm just gonna have to pick up. Oh. Oh. Yeah, so this is what's gonna get it started. Fucking 13 bullet. Just need to stay close to the hell. Okay, that's it. I'm a lunatic, so fuck off. Alright. No, you fucking idiot. Oh my god. Why did. I literally had the fucking assault rifle in my hand and I must have hit the RT butt by accident and um, I switched weapon it just sucks whenever you go into these kinds of missions with nothing because you have to play it so tactically that it's, it just wastes so much time and then when you do fail like I did right now it's just a waste of waste of time I just don't know if there's any guns around oh my the God, building. Tony, do something. How did that last one hit? Yeah, I'm already dead. And the other thing that sucks is there's no, um... What you call it? There's no. <clears throat> There's no uh, ammunition on that side of town either. <laughs> Uh, 
caterpillar. Oh my god, Tony, do something! I'm gonna go around this little, um, thing. Oh, there's nothing. They're all running. Bro, I have no fucking guns, man. The best thing that I could do is steal one of their cars and just run them all over. Okay, that guy has a gun. Bro, get the gun. <laughs> Looking too bad. Fuck, okay. <clears throat> I should probably go get some health. Look guys, I know a lot of you guys are, why don't you just go get the guns, get your shit, and be like strapped and ready to go. The thing is, guys, I'm just trying to get this fucking mission over with. Damn, dude. It doesn't help that they already come like with fucking M4s. Um. Damn, dude. Oh my god, Tony, do something! I have high hopes though for this one. I think this is gonna be it. Bro, I just need one of those dudes to come with the pistol. Those guys have fucking full blown M4s, dude. The next smartest thing to do is just steal the fucking car that they came in, just run them all over. Yeah, look, they're all fucking glitched out right there. Literally, dude, that's probably the smartest thing to do. Run in circles. I'm the giant oh. Dude, right Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope, I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Fuck! Dude, the health was right there! <laughs> All right, this is my last try, guys. If I can't get it in this try, then I'm just gonna have to go like full blown army. I'm gonna have to bring a tank. I'm just gonna have to get everything. This is fucking stupid. It seems like they start glitching out though at the um at that tree, so. As long as I can bring them towards that tree, steal a car, hit them, and then get at least some guns, then I'll be fine. Oh my god, Tony, do something! Yeah, look, so you just get them all running right there. Right? And you go around, steal a vehicle, and you crash them. <laughs> Maybe I should do that for everybody that comes, right? Be, like, super tactical. Where's the fucking car? Did they not pull up in a vehicle? this one dude right there. dude i can't do this i need a fucking car shut up dude my god there's and there's one of the vehicles too There goes half my fucking health right there, dude. Oh, man, this fucking game. I'm dead. And then what? I'm the fattest guy I've found. I need to go get that other fucking health that was right there. <sighs> okay. Not looking too bad, guys, but damn! Many more are there? There's one that I'm gonna meet right here. And he had had a fucking M4. Ugh, damn it! Nope, I'm dead. Bro, is there any more fucking health out here? Looks like that's the last bit of them. Dude, thank 
God. D, come on, let's go. Oh my God, it look what you've done to my beautiful car. I gave you a bunch of D, new cars. We could do some landscaping or escaping. It's up to you. Get me to the airport. Let's fucking go, dude. Damn. Let's get to the airport. And the thing is, the, the mission's not even over. Ah, uh, fuck, okay. The quickest. Because they're, they're gonna be coming for me. About time you fucking leave the state, though. Fucking Donald, you bitch. That had to have been the hardest mission of the game. Not necessarily so much. Well, I mean, yes, because I didn't have shit, and because of the fact of like how those guys come at you, they already come at you with full-blown M4s and a bunch of crazy-ass machine guns. Those M4s are fucking overkill, and they're OP. Damn. I'm just glad I'm already like kind of already seen the light at the end of the tunnel. You even know how to fly a plane? Goodbyes, my friend. Shut up. Let's just say adieu. The Tired of that guy. It's been an education. I'm fucking fed up with that dude. <clears throat> now the smartest thing to do right here is save. <laughs> Get some health. That way, if I fail the next few missions, which I might, there's two left for Salvatore Leone. It's now been confirmed that the wide scale destruction of Fort Staunton was caused by a armor? series of underground explosions. I could have sworn I saw that. that the Mafia linked yes. The family were using the Shut up, bitch. Um. Hell yeah. I'm gonna be set up pretty good um in these last two missions. It's now been confirmed that the wide scale destruction of Fort Staunton was caused by a series of underground explosions. Rumors suggest that the mafia linked Forelli. Liberty. It's now been confirmed that the wide-scale destruction of Fort Staunton was caused by a series of underground explosions. Rumors suggest that the mafia linked Forelli family were using the derelict subway running beneath the area to stockpile an arsenal of munitions for their gang wars. It's not known at this time whether this terrible tragedy was caused by the weapons cachet accidentally being ignited or if foul play was involved. Tune in later for more details on LCN. Look at that damn. And I trust we'll have a better caller over here. I did not trust. I'm the first time caller. Oh, don't tell me. You're a vampire. Ooh, I'm scared. What is wrong with you freaks? Okay? Your music is horrible. Turn on a light. But this is Lazlo, huh? Fucking that guy's a legend. Why do you not trust me? If you keep it going, you're coming. You you should say both. Dude, I'm really I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm having a really bad show. Okay, okay. Let's just say. All right. Alright guys, save, get some health, or first get the health, then save. Look at that. <laughs> nice and replenished with plenty fucking guns. We're almost there. Fuck yeah. 
Well, not plenty guns, but enough. I'm waiting for a call in Salvatore, so let me get out. Drink my beer. I didn't even do anything! Ah, that means I have to wear the stupid lawyer outfit. Hold up. Let me go change. Yeah, because if I come up uh, to visit Salvatore in a fucking Leone suit, we're sure going to get him. Well, I don't know if I need it, right? I don't know if I need this suit, but I'd rather be safe than to be sorry. Way there, guys. Uh, still looking good on time, so. Sal, you there? Anthony, I'm getting out. My arraignment today. Great. Yeah, but I got this sauce and the Sicilians so want me to make it to court. With me in here, who's stopping them from taking over? Hey, they'd have to get by me first, Sal. Yeah, Tony, whatever. Just make sure I get my day in court. Hey, the guards are coming now. I'll see you around the front. All right, let's do it. Get a police car. There was... Uh... <laughs> oh, there's one right there. Perfect. There's a fucking bill ass machine gun right there. <clears throat> so am I supposed to just guide him there, watch out for him, or am I supposed to hijack the thing? Oh, escort oh, paper. <sighs> and I can promise you, sometime in between the Sindacos or the Pirellis or whoever gonna try to kill him. Right there. No, that's the construction book. Never mind. Almost there, guys. Nope, we're already gonna get fucked. I think that's a whole ass shock. Oh, fuck! Okay, he's on the right side, he's on the right side, he's on the right side, he's on the right side. I might die, I might die, I might die. Holy shit! Fuck. I need that. Well, I mean, the fucking sh rocket launcher's still there, isn't it? Yeah, I need that for sure. What is that? A uh, I didn't get it. Alright, this mission wasn't a total loss. <clears throat> it 
because I was able to get a rocket launcher out of the deal. You know me, I fail one. I always fail the first time. Sal, you there? Yes, bitch. I hope the cop car's still over there. Yep. That's yeah, funny because as soon as I get this one, then the other one spawns over there. Let's do it. I know what happens, I know what Holy fucking shit. happens. to take out the blockade dude why is that and how is that my job be another blockade right here. Yeah, I see it. Wait, no. I don't know where the f Ugh. Okay, yeah, it's right here. Forget the attempt with the van. Oh, I'm not forgetting, dude. How the fuck am I gonna forget? Bro, the thing is, like, these NPCs are just too fucking... Nah, that thing's already gonna blow up. I didn't pass it. There's no way. My cop car's about to blow up. And this fucking... Watch, as soon as he hits him... How much more, how much more do you guys need to go? Turn the fuck up. Cause my fucking cop car's about to explode. There better not be any more either. Now just load, what the fuck? But what sucks is like I don't I'm not gonna have the that rocket launcher. Dude. 
Fucking damn. Yeah, my honestly, guys, my goal for this stream was to be like, a, I don't know, like an hour. <laughs> I'm already bleeding into the two hour mark, though. But I ain't gonna stop until I beat this stupid ass game. Wait for the phone call. Can we get a move on, please? Tony, this is Sal. Get the shore side re redemption. I don't know. <clears throat> oh, there's a cop car behind there. Alright, let's do this. So this time around, I think I ki kind of have a strategy. Instead of letting him plow through those guys, I'll have to plow through them myself. Um, but my biggest concern is just the health of the police car. Or what I'm going to try to do is like if I could shoot them. If I could shoot the, the cars to like enable them to move, because what it seems like is like as soon as I tap them, then they start moving. So, holy shit. Get the fuck up. Look at them. They're all over there. I think they're going the other way. Yeah, so I kind of know the route now. I think he goes left. You see? Then that enables them to move. Oh, and they leave. What? Oh, this is fuck this is gonna be cake then. They already did. Oh, there's another one right there. Yeah, this this is gonna be cake. If if that's all they do is just like get all scared and leave, then that this is gonna be uh, smooth sailing. Now, well, there is one that's on him. But at least they're not taking that much damage, because the, the last time that all this was going down, like, they were, this dude was, like, taking damage. And then there should be one more on the bridge that I know of. Man, this mission's actually not as hard as I thought. Yeah, that's the only thing though, is I can't, I can't get too far from the van. And I just have to wait until it says, Ugh, fuck, I should not have looked back. Because when you look back, then they spawn. Come on, dude.
As long as he's like, as long as he's not taking significant amount of damage, then I don't really care. I need that fucking, I need a new vehicle. And then there should be one more coming down around. <clears throat> yeah, take out the blockade. So as soon as they tell me to take out the blockade, then that's when I could actually proceed. Never mind. Liberty <laughs> City. even notice that. I thought both cars had a uh, one dude in them man I was overthinking this mission this mission's not even that hard knock on wood <laughs> he's gonna hit the corner dude I can't believe that's literally what fucking did it in the last mission and then the other police station should be pretty close yep I was that close to beating the mission the last time around. That's bullshit. That is fucking horseshit. It's good to be a free man again. But listen, I'm gonna head up to the house and get out of these stinking rags, okay? I'll meet you up there. All right. It's the last mission right here, guys. <clears throat> and this is like... There's no filter in this one. I'm literally gonna burn all my money on weaponry. And I'm gonna blow all my money on, on weaponry. And then um, I'm gonna get ready. I should have gone to Phil's. Yeah, let me get a sniper. Get a few grenades. For sure that. Armor. I'm gonna get some AK as well. Yep. I should be good. <laughs> Where's he at? Oh, he's at his house. Okay. I have a feeling though that this mission is gonna make me drive throughout like the entire map. Uh, where is? Next time, we're gonna tell women more strategies for making a successful family life with the help of my newest book, 15 Minutes to Domestic Heaven. Oh, and if you're trying to lose weight, I got some great new weight loss tips from Columbia. Now remember what my daddy said. Why is there police barricades on there? Whoa, 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 what the fuck? It's still being constructed? Oh, no shit. I thought it was already done. So to get back, I need to jump the fucking ramp. That's stupid. Yeah, I thought that bridge was already built. But to be fair, they didn't have me in previous missions. They didn't have me going back to this island. Portland Island. Oh boy. Yeah, guys, it's a bittersweet moment right here. Bittersweet in regards that um, I'm done with all of the PlayStation 2 Grand Theft Autos. Again, I said in the last part, uh, Vice City, um, Vice City Stories, Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto Liberty City uh, stories now, and then uh, San Andreas. 
Um, and where it's fucking um, bittersweet is the fact that I'm tired of these fucking games. These games were fucking hard, dude. I don't know how I was able to beat them. As a kid, at least. If I'm struggling as an adult, damn. Fucking damn. Alrighty, let me change. Make it right. Mm-hmm. He has full health. Let me save. And let's get to it. The moment all you guys have been looking forward to. The final mission of GTA Liberty City Stories. love and check all right guys this is it quick speech before we get into this last mission it's been a hell of a fucking ride it's been a span of over two years i want to say or maybe a year and a half i don't i don't quite recall when i started the vice city definitive edition but damn dude five ps2 slash psp grant the photo games and this is literally the final mission of it um yeah, dude, I mean, I don't have, I don't know really what to say. I'm just like, holy fuck, like, we're really here. We're finally done. We're finally at the last mission. Thank you. Thank you to all my viewers. Thank you to everybody that's ever even interacted with the Dumzo Danino channel. So, yeah, guys, let's get into this and let's finish off the GTA PS2 slash PSP era of GTAs, I guess. No, I'll talk to you later. Hey, Tony! Oh, you're back where you belong. Hey, we're both back. You and me, we did it, huh? You know it. We cleaned it up with the Ferrellis, the Sindacos we sent into the fucking sea. Now I got the Sicilians on the phone wanting peace. We all want peace. But my peace, not their fucking peace. I'm the big man now. No chump from the old country is going to tell me what to do. I That's told right. him to go fuck themselves. Hey, I, I, that was. hey, I'm the boss now. Me. Now let's go see the mayor about getting my charges dropped. <clears throat> All right, let's see how this should end. Head over to City Hall without any Sicilian advice. Right? See, they all, oh, they, like, they try to make it seem like it's going to be an easy mission, but uh, there's going to be a whole ass ambush that we walk into. Well, we're going to have to fight with the fucking government and shit. And I'm quite uh, curious to see, because usually um, in past streams, oh, my stream will cut off around like right now. So I'm going to be checking to make sure that that doesn't happen. Yeah, I don't know. Whenever I used to live back with my parents, like the internet that we got really only allowed me to do um uh like two hours of stream, and that was it. Oh my god, it was in the other city. What's the point of coming all the fuck way over here, making me jump a damn bridge if we're just gonna go back to the other city regardless, dude? And your house is fucking far. It's not close. Please don't crash, please don't crash, please don't crash. And I fucking crashed. <laughs> well, that took out quarter health of each um, of my health and my armor. 
Not too bad, but also definitely wish it didn't happen. Was so easy. Lousy bastards have taken him already. So they got the mayor hostage and for the pier. So now, uh oh, how the fuck? No, can't go down. How the fuck do I get down there? Oh, I think I need to go all the way over there. What the fuck? Honestly, they make it so hard just to get where you're supposed to be at, um, because like the streets are like also vertical. All right, here we go. Fuck yeah. All right, Oplex, so check it out. This is the, the last mission. And, um, yeah. That's the ceilings and the flies. Come on, Tony. This way. I'll drive. You then after you this, I'm literally done with all the Grand Theft Autos from, like, the PlayStation 2 and PSP era, so. Where did those come from? <clears throat> Where are they? Holy shit, this one has a minigun now. Fucking don't drive too fast, bro. Fuck. Can't even aim. Portland Island. Yeah, dude, this is already the last one right here. Should be easy. Well, I mean, I'm not. I don't want to say it should be easy and then fucking fail like five times. But so far, it's been pretty smooth. Especially because I have the right fucking artillery. Look at that. Smooth. 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 God damn, dude! It's like some fucking crazy ass action movie right here it's like some Sylvester Stallone shit uh fuck
Where are they at? Oh fuck, dude. Well, I'm the fucking the bow has taken already all kinds of damage. Ugh. Okay, we're here. Ah! All right, guys. <laughs> How many bastards are on this rock? All of them. You shoot one bastard and another one bites you on the ass. Literally, got the thought on a nutshell. Uh, let me go get that. Yeah, keep that. Oh shit, I didn't even get it. it sucks because I can't really see. How? In what way? In what fucking way did he die? Did he just fall? Oh my god. Oh, dude. Thank you, Liberty City Stories. This is the only time you did something right, dude. Fuck. I'd have to do all that nonsense driving. I could do the, the boat shit all over again. I don't really care. But the fucking... All that driving and all that other bullshit, like, damn. Shut up, bitch. Huh? What you want some dick? Uh, somebody followed me. Shout out to CJSDTV2, whatever. I can't really read. I'm in the middle of a mission. Shout out to that guy. Thank you for the follow. If you haven't noticed, we're out here playing some Liberty City stories. This is the last mission. Um. Yeah, thank you for joining. Thank you for following. Dude, the fucking bow has taken some damage already. Alrighty. Almost there. Salvatore, don't fall in the fucking ocean again, all right? <laughs> all right, let's do this. Fuck, dude, I heard something fall in the water. I thought it was him again. I think that's how I failed the, that mission the last time was because... Bro, there's a fucking dude right there. I want that gun. I was gonna chuck a grenade out there, but I'm afraid that's gonna come back down and fucking blow up uh, Salvatore, so I'm not even trying to do that. 
Should I try, guys? Oh, no, I think I already killed them. Perfect. <clears throat> what the fuck? Don't kill him! Carini, it figures. Give him up. The mayor is mine. This city is mine. Salvatore. Cecily never wanted Christos keep for the cheap. But when tribute to Dryla, what could we do? It was nothing personal. Nothing personal? After what you put me through, I'm gonna tear your fucking heart out. Alright, so there's body armor. Oh shit. Uh, no, let's get the body armor. Um. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah. Oh, that was easy. <clears throat> Mission passed? <laughs> Please? I'm ready. Ready to hit the button. Hey, Mr. Mayor. We just Hello. saved you from a bunch of crazy societies. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> that means... Uh, For real? <laughs> just drop the whole helicopter. Grateful to you. Ow. Try again. That you... Work for me, right? Oh, yeah, uh, that I work for you. Good. Now, don't call us, we'll call you. Get out of here, prick. Thank you, Mr. Leone. Tony, we did it. We run things now, you and me. We're a team, huh? Now, I just need you to do one small thing for me. I got some problems that I've been dealing with. Like what? Bro, that far sound always gets me. <laughs> yeah, I gotta use my this little soundboard more often. Hey, Uncle, how you doing, huh? You look good. <laughs> ah, Salvatore. All we really wanted was clarity. Yes, Uncle, I appreciate that. So. We are at peace now, you and the old country. Of course, me and all my people. Good, very good. Hmm. Are we gonna kill him? Sneaky little bastard. I wouldn't trust him a fucking inch. <laughs> Yeah, but we did it. Yeah, we cleaned up. <laughs> you did good, Tony. You did real good. I Tell did everything. You Fuck you. you. Saved my ass a few times, and I appreciate that kind of loyalty. Thank you. A good worker? I like that. Respectful. So I got you that half million I promised you. Half? Ooh, I thought you uh, said a couple. <laughs> I said one million dollars. For what? You can put a price on friendship? The kind of friendship you and me have? Shame on you. Come here. Damn. You're a good kid. <laughs> but shame on you. But well, what? You think fucking killing a bunch of people's free? You only give them half a million dollars? That's bullshit. At least give them like 50. Oh, that's it, guys. That's it. That's it, guys. GTA Vice City Stories, GTA Vice City, GTA San Andreas, GTA Vice City Stories, and GTA 3, they're all in the fucking books, guys. Officially, the Grand Theft Auto era for PS2 has been completed on Dunzo Danino's channel. Fuck yeah. If I had a fucking bottle or if it was a Saturday, I would have took a shot for that shit right now. But yeah, guys, we are done. 
it was a hell of a ride, dude. Like, I, I'm trying to remember when I even started the Vice City, um, the original Vice City, because that's the one that I started doing. <clears throat> yeah, because I, I remember me wanting to play these games again started back when... Um, it started back, I was playing uh, Red Dead Redemption, and then I saw that the, defin the definitive edition of the GTAs for the PS2 were coming out, so it was GTA Vice City, San Andreas, and GTA 3. And I said, I'm gonna fucking stream those like as soon as I get them, and I sure as hell did. And the first one was GTA Vice City, and I started that stream, but it was after Bully, after I streamed Bully. <clears throat> so that one I uploaded back in August, on August 8th, 2022. And today is January 14th, 2024. So I've literally been playing these games or streaming these games to the best of my ability for over a year and maybe what, like four months. So, I mean, I'm glad. I'm glad it's over. But damn, that was one hell of a ride. So much nostalgic uh, parts from fucking Catalina, Hilly, or trying to kill Claude in GTA 3 to fucking burning down a weed farm in GTA San Andreas, having to deal with Lance and his dumbass in GTA Vice City and Vice City Stories. And well, I mean, I don't have too much memory from Vice City Stories or Liberty, Liberty City Stories. But yeah, guys, it was it was definitely a road down memory lane. <clears throat> you need to play Red Dead Redemption, the original one. I do already have it, dude. I've already played it and I, I think I played that like maybe two years ago, so that one's already completed. Um, it's uh the good that one was on Xbox 360. Oh wait, are you talking about Red Dead Revolver? Are you talking about Red Dead Redemption, the one for 360? Um, looks like zombie. I think you're talking about the OG OG one, and that one I think is called Red Dead Re Revolver. I don't remember. I don't remember, but um. The one for PS2. Yeah, there, there's a, a Red Dead Redemption called Red Dead Re Revolver, and that one was originally on the PS2. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I don't know if I have it. Um, I mean, but I could always download it and put it on here. Yeah, I'll definitely look into that. Um, but yeah, um, I'm trying to think. Oh, but yeah, guys, like, so I know my next game that I'm going to play, it's going to be a redo. And... I'm not gonna say this is my first redo because I technically did a redo with San Andreas but the game that I chose to redo is Grand Theft Auto 4 but this time around I'm also gonna play The Lost and Damned and The Ballad of Gay Tony just so I can clear out that one as well and then after that I plan on stepping up to GTA 5. Those games I all of it all of it collectively I mean today is January 14th so it's so early in the year but all of those games collectively, I want to have beat by the by the summer. So if I can beat those games by the summers, that would be good. And the reason that I'm choosing to redo those games or to redo GTA 4 is because <clears throat> I want to be able to incorporate the, the YouTube shorts that I've been doing with all the other GTAs. I want to do that with this one. Um, there's one mission I always quit. Uh... It's one of the last other ones. Uh, are you talking about on Red Dead Re Revolver? Oplex? Um, but yeah, guys, that's that's so far the future that's going on with this channel. Um, and then when I hop into GTA 5, I mean, I don't really have a timeline of when I'm going to finish that one, but I'm going to do GTA 5, the main story. And then after that, we'll see where I go. After, after GTA 5, I might go back to doing retro games, like some PS2 games. There's a whole, like, series that I've been looking at. I'm either going to do some Dragon Ball Z, or I'm going to go as far back and do um, Ratchet and Clank. I don't know if you guys know those games, but I'm, I want to try to do those. Um, and then I might also go back and, and do that game that Oplex is talking about, Red Dead Revolver. And then working my way back up to be able to play Red Dead Redemption 2. Because I've been wanting to play that game for a long time. Just never really got to it um yeah guys i really don't have too much more to say just enjoying the credits enjoying a beer enjoying this sunday uh the rams are playing today guys 
And I also believe the other football game just started. Let me see. Oh yeah, so the Packers and the Cowboys are gonna start kickoff here in six minutes. So that's perfect. Uh, Oplex, you can go watch some fucking football after this if you don't like it. Oh yes, and you know what? You brought up a good thing too. Um, the Red Dead Redemption, I'm um, the Red Dead Redemption, the Resident Evil series, dude, like, trust me, I'll, I'll go as far back as to playing Re uh, Resident Evil 1, 2, 3, and all of those, dude, like, I'm a huge fan of it. I'm a huge fan of those games. Um, and I have all the new ones, too. I have Resident Evil 5, 6, and I think the 7th one just came out, and I have them. I <laughs> just never play them. Um, but yeah, no, you're right. Res Resident Evil, for sure, without a fucking doubt, I'm going to go back to those. Um, let's see, what else? What else? What other, what other good games are there? Um, oh, I do have an Oculus, so I'll probably do some funny, like, Oculus streams here now here and there Silent Hill dude. I've never played Silent Hill. I do want to play it, but it's just Those games are scarier than shit i am be honest those games are fucking scarier than shit Silent Hill 2 on the ps2 is scary as fuck <clears throat> Damn these are some long-ass credits But if one thing's for sure, guys, is I don't want to... You know what? I'm thinking about it. Because if, if I said collectively the GTA 4 I want to finish by summer, GTA 5 is probably going to bleed me out another two to three months. And that'll be... Like September of 2024. And GTA 6 is supposed to come out, I think, around that time, too. So maybe that'll be a good transition onto that game. Unless I can find another game to fill in the gap that's an easy game, then I'll do it. But yeah, uh, me either. But they even have a movie for Silent Hill. I didn't know that. Fatal Frame, Fatal Frame is a fucking scary ass game, too, because that one's actually like. I'm not going to say it's real, but it's projected like a, what can be real, I guess. Um, yeah, there's, 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 um, some Fatal Frame games for the PS2 as well. I, I mean, I'm not opposed to it. I'm definitely not my preference. <laughs> I fucking hate scary shit, but yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. Can we like hurry up? Oh, wait, I didn't even know I could control this. I'm just trying to catch the Cowboys kickoff already. It's in three minutes. <clears throat> Alrighty. Oh, well, there's always, like, people who call you after. Oh, I can just do it fast. Fuck it. I'll just do that. Yeah, because there's always, like, people who end up calling you after the game and shit like that. See, that would have been a good another five minutes right there for sure. Can I just push start? No, I have to go. I think that's it right there. All right, guys, that does it. Half a million in the fucking bank. Let's go. Shout out to Leone, although you owe me like 50 million instead of the half a million. But uh, yeah, said King Jumpsuit is in the thing. I'm assuming people are going to be calling him. So I'll give it another few minutes. Um, but yeah, if not, I'm, I'm going to end up calling it raps. Or you know what? Let's let's do this for um for good measure for old time's sake. Let's just fucking go on a killing spree, fuck it. See how far I could get. Or how many cops I could get. All right, looks like nobody's gonna call Tony. I have grenades, what the fuck? Just start chucking grenades. <laughs> Damn.
All right, three stars. Should be fun. Oh, shit. Well, there goes the majority of my health. I uh, have 12 grenades. All right, there we go. Four star, baby. I think this is the first four star I ever got in this game. I just want that health. Oh, fuck. I was like, who the hell is shooting at me? Nah, he's gonna, these guys are gonna end up killing me right here. Bro, aim at him, Tony. Nah, there's too many guys. Alrighty, guys, I gave it a shot. I only got to four stars and then they got me. Um, but yeah, guys, like I said in closing, shout out to everybody that stopped by in this stream. Shout out to Oplik. Shout out to everybody else that followed me on the stream. Drowsy and CJ Yesta TV 2 underscore zero. Shout out to you guys. You guys are the reason why, um, you know, I could make it anywhere in this fucking, in this Twitch world, I guess you could say. Um, yeah, guys. I mean, again, thank you to all you guys. Thank you to everybody that watches this on YouTube. Thank you to those that watch my shorts. Thank you to those who that comment and like all that stuff. Continue to grow my channel and continue to grow every grow everything else. Hopefully, I could get to my goal sometime this year and make some money off of this shit. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see. But um, yeah, guys. Again, if you're watching this on Twitch, go to my YouTube. Check me out over there. Subscribe. Yada yada yada. If you're on YouTube, go over to the Twitch. Uh, follow me over there. Stop by whenever you have the chance. Drink a beer with me. Talk to me. Yada yada yada. Oplix already know the deal on that. Um, some more channel news. I do plan on bringing back the the podcast that I had started. Just give me some time with that. Uh, let me get used to doing all this stuff again, and then I'll bring that back. Um, but yeah, guys. Other other than that, thank you for stopping by. GTA's for PS2s are completely done. The next one you'll see me do next week is the redo of GTA 4 alongside Lost and Dam and the Ballad of Gay Tony. That way I can implement those in YouTube shorts and all that great stuff. But yeah, guys, until next week, go Rams. Hopefully they could win it today. Peace and fucking chicken grease, my boys. I'll see you guys in the next one.